Adventures in space have been starting to appear more and more in VR. One new game to add to the list is Downward Spiral Horus Station, developed and published by Third Eye Studios. So the real question is, is Downward Spiral good? Downward Spiral Horus Station starts off inside of a space station, but you're given no context to why you were there. You actually only leave the space station a few times in the game. I'll explain more about the storytelling later. The game itself has you searching the rooms of a massive space station while trying to reactivate all functions of the station. The controls of the game have you grabbing surfaces to push yourself around. For the first few minutes it was annoying, but you soon get tools to help you move around more efficiently. There are also active robots in the station trying to attack you, but luckily you have weapons to defend yourself. You gather multiple different weapons throughout the game that increasingly get stronger. The game relies heavily on exploration. You're going to get lost a few times in the game, and for a decent amount of people, it's going to be too boring for them. If you're not that into exploration, you might not enjoy this game. One thing I have to mention is the use of turning. In the VR mode, there's only click turning. I personally don't care whether smooth turning is in VR games or not, but I know that a lot of people do care, so I just wanted to mention that. Downward Spiral consists of 7 acts. These acts can take anywhere from 30 minutes to an hour and the entire game took me around 6 hours to beat. You can also play the entire game with another player. I personally wasn't able to check out this mode, but from what I heard from other reviewers and footage on live streams, it looks awesome. Now I wanted to talk a little more about the developer's approach to storytelling in this game. The developers went for the show don't tell approach. You'll never see any moments in the game where they just dump a ton of story context on you. It's all told through the environments and cutscenes. I thought they pulled this off very well. I have my own interpretation of the story, but I'm sure other people think different things. And that's one of the great parts of Downward Spiral. It's the mystery of the story. Overall, Downward Spiral Horror Station is a fantastic game. The environments combined with the storytelling is really something special. And the music in the game is fantastic. It really fit with the environments. The gameplay never blew me away, but at points it gets really fun. Like I said, it relies heavily on exploration and mixes a little bit of combat in there. But for those of you who enjoy exploration, or just the idea of storytelling through visuals, should love this game. If you're not into a slower paced game like this, you're probably not going to enjoy it. But for me, this was a fantastic game.